Uh, about five achievements. So that's what we're here to do. Let's do it. YouTube, Twitch, Twitch, YouTube. Proven? It's proven or proven? What's up, crit scan? I'm going to try infinite mode again because I verified the integrity of my files. So now that my files have some integrity, maybe I can play infinite mode. Without having it crash. We will find out. It crashes every time. And it's really annoying. Let's see if I even remember how to play this game. But this will probably be the end. With Metroidvania Mania, we're trying to get 70% achievements on all games that we play. If they have achievements, and this game is no exception. We are currently at about 60% of the achievements. That was a bad first room. This game is number four. The fat yuck shirt or the mouse pad. I will say, I do like the little bat yuck in the corner right there. I like the corner shirts. I Granted, I think the background of the bat yuck is good regardless, but I'm just a fan of the little pocket shirts. Proven. Proven. Proven is EN. Hopefully, the integrity of my files work, and if not, hopefully, Zark Attack will be in this chat again. Developer, we need you. Proven. Do you think a Hyuk shirt would be good to wear to a wedding? Bro, the fucking bride and groom will be in Hyuk merch. You kidding me? Oh, well, mate, the bride, the, the couple it doesn't have to be a bride and a groom. It could be a, a groom and a groom, a bride and a bride. Two people getting married. Either way, the couple will be rocking the Hyuk merch themselves. Now, what will be game number five on Metroidvania Mania? The base word is pronounced like prove. Why would it make prove the voices? What up, Chibi? Good luck with those achievements. Thanks. I'm hoping my game is not bugged and I can actually get these achievements. There is probably an achievement I can get right now if I take that helmet. You know what? Fuck it. Let's take the helmet and then we'll restart. Boom. Absorb two explosions with a helmet. There we go. Achievement unlocked. There's a house getting knocked down on my block. It goes so fast. The house going down? Is this a metaphor to think about how fast life goes and how your home that you once loved will be destroyed? Cautionary tale to not have a house fire. Speaking of house fires, fucking Jasper, uh, the national park, Jasper National Park, that whole area is burning right now, like fucking burning up, which is making the air quality here worse. But fucking Jasper, they had to evacuate the whole city. It's crazy because it's only a few hours away from me. 
And it's also heartbreaking because Jasper National Park, I've never been there. I've only seen photos, but based off the photos I've seen, it looks like one of the most beautiful places on Earth. And it's just burning up. God, I hate those guys. Why is Canada always on fire? Who does it think it is? California? Eh, Canada's just on fire in the summer. On fire in the summer. Don't tell your mother. I'm gonna die here, so I'm just gonna retry. I already messed up the beginning of this because I like having uh, the little buddy after the first area, but I took the helmet to get an achievement. It was worth it, by the way. So let's just redo this. We'll see if we can survive by verify. We verified the integrity of the files. Now we'll see if we can survive. Alberta's on fire. This province is on fire. Please help us. All right, easy first couple waves. What up, Lotus Dragon? We just started singing at the same time. That's how you know you're meant to be with a streamer, as in watch the streamer. That's how you know you found the right streamer. If you and that streamer you're watching start singing in unison, there's obviously a lot more things that can guarantee if you like watching a streamer, just in if you're entertained by them. But if you start singing in unison, I don't know what more you need to see. The brain waves. There's a connection. This is not going good right now. Shield boys are messing me up. But I messed them up. Freaking Dr. Zoidberg hit me twice. Dr. Zoidberg hit me twice. But we're going to take the little buddy because the little buddy is definitely the best thing because he actually shoots stuff. You lose him when you die, so basically you get him the entire time in infinity mode, I'm pretty sure. In infinite mode. Until infinite mode crashes and you have to cry. Now we're getting five times combos. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. 
Found out the sad fate of your car. What is the sad fate of your car? Oh, I didn't even get a five times combo. You sold your car a few months ago for $200 because the exhaust blew. $200? Because the exhaust blew? Oh my god. See, I just blew myself up and took so much damage. It was crushed. I'm sorry you had to sell your car and now you probably have no way to get around in the sad world that is Earth. All right, we're on to the third floor. My game has crashed every time I've gotten to the like third area of the third floor, and there's like three achievements locked past the fourth, the fourth floor. So I'm hoping my game will. Uh... I verified the integrity of the files, and I'm going to hope that it does not crash. A man can hope, right? And if my game does crash again, I'll just say it's a game issue. If you verify the integrity of the files and you're still having issues, it's a game issue. You talk to your husband and you don't know if it went well. Did he not take what you were asking seriously or what? I'm sorry, it might not have went well. God, I hate those guys. You got kind of defensive and was quiet all night. I'm sorry, throat.
You do not know? I mean, you did what you needed to do. I don't know your husband personally, so I don't know how he processes things. But I hope he doesn't, you know, take it, like, personally. That's what a partnership is, you know? When something, someone's not having their needs fulfilled, they have to say, hey, this is what I need. And then you can be like, this is how we should fix this. And yeah, I hope that he can process it in a healthy way and help out when he can, you know? God, this enemy is so annoying. This is where my game always crashes as well. Will the game crash? Hey! Oh my fucking god. Uh, Zark attack? You're not in here, probably, but every time. Every time. Every time. There's three achievements locked behind that fucking mode with clear four runs, which is four areas, which I was about to get to the fourth, 100,000 points, can't get it until the fourth or longer area, and get a 10 times combo, which you can't get until past the fourth area. And it's really annoying that my game crashes every single time. Every time. Every time. Hey, yay, yay, man. That's just, it's just annoying. It's just so annoying. Look up Starve Province. Not right now. Right now, damn it. No, I have exophobia to play. We're in the middle of fine. I've done I've done weirder in the middle of YouTube let's plays. I'm pretty sure I've looked up Star of Province before. Cause that name is so familiar. It's literally on my wish list. Overwhelmingly positive. Oh yeah, I, I saw this and added it to my wish list immediately. I thought that game looked great. All right, now let's enable controller because it always goes to mouse and keyboard every time. I guess I just need to get a bunch of achievements from. I just need to get a bunch of achievements from. Uh, this, I guess. All right, let's go to the second floor. We'll pet all the dogs. We'll go to floor number two and we'll start petting all the dogs, I guess. We'll pet all the dogs. Are we even in the right area? Making sure we're on the right floor. This is indeed the right floor. There's something in the middle of this room over here. The dog is in a corner. Let's go find the dog and pet said dog. Let me save right here. What's up, rhinos? We'll save the progress. We'll have to make sure we don't use these too much if we want to collect 10 items. How many CDs did I miss? There's a CD there. There's an achievement for holding 10 items we could try to get, but 
the CDs will get deposited every time if we uh, collect one. CD there that I missed. There's a couple CDs on this area. Three CDs. Never even been over here, but it doesn't seem like there's anything over there. A cat in Star Province. Gotta have your kitty CD there. Isn't that right near me? There's a CD right near me. And there's a filter right near me as well. And there's a dog near me as well. Alright, wait a minute. Can I? No, 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 no. I just want to take these off. Can I get that CD? Oh, I definitely can. Alright, that was easy. There's a color filter here. Might be another CD over here, actually. Oh, wait, yeah, we can get this one right here because we have a teleporter. So we got another CD right there. I don't know how to get that color filter, though. Oh, wait. Virtual filter. Okay, well, I'm gonna turn off the virtual filter because it hurts my eyes and I'm a coward. I'm a coward. I don't think that joke has been made yet. Uh, I just like the classic right now, the no filter, but we're collecting them all. Okay, so the dog is in a corner. I think we want to go this way for the dog. No, actually, we want to go the way we were just were. Get rid of these things. Get rid of these annoying things. Gotta kill them all. Wait, I think I walked past where the dog is. I might have walked past the dog. It's hard to tell with this map. And my battery is gonna die soon, so I can't even hold 10 items. I think the dog is actually... No! I can't even go back there! Fuck! Oh, no! I go all the way around. I probably should have saved. What the fuck? Oh, 
Oh, this is the end of the game. Well, this is awkward. I walked past the dog by accident. By accident. And now I feel like I am stuck here. Is there like an option to not have the map die? That would be, like, so useful. Like, I beat the game with the map dying already. I feel in terms of trying to get the achievements, it's fine if I don't. If I, like, you know, let the map die. That goes two of my CDs. How many CDs do we have? We have 35 out of 44. Alright. I need to get back over here. We have a CD over here as well. And we have two more CDs over here. Also, Gigi, I hope you're doing good. Two CDs over there. We have a third CD over there. Oh, geez, we gotta walk all the way through this map. Elevator there. There's a gem on this right side of the map, which gives us a secret ending if we wanted to go for that as well. I couldn't even find the gem on the first part of the map. So where am I? I'm here. I have to go all the way down to the, to the right, maybe. And we can get the CD here and a CD here. Then we can go back. The dog is in this corner, if I'm not mistaken. It sh the dog should be in this little corner. Right here, which I missed. Not too bad, not too bad. Not too bad, not too bad. I'm glad, I'm glad. Alright. How's the Chivos looking? I have verified the integrity of my files and I'm still stuck not being able to get three achievements because uh, I have three achievements locked behind infinity mode, but I'm at 62%. So we need to grab a few more. Right now I'm trying to collect all the CDs along with like, petting all the dogs. There's four dogs on the map, one on each floor. I've pet the one on the first floor. So if I can pet those dogs, that'll be another one. And I'm nine CDs away from having them all. There's also an achievement for killing all the Zarconians, but I don't know how close I am to that one. But we're close, we're close. It should take a couple hours. A couple hours would be my guess. All right, we're back here. I got one already for using a helmet to survive two explosions. That one was easy. Even though I couldn't really find the helmet. Wait a minute. Can you show me on the map where these are? Let me cheat. I don't know if pinning them does anything, but I need nine more CDs and three of them are on here, so. I could also go for all the color filters, but those are kind of spread out far and wide, and it's kind of annoying to traverse. I will say it is kind of annoying traversing the map. Because everything's kind of like... Some doors that you need to go through are locked, and then you have to walk through like the entire whole map again. And it's just like, do I really want to do that? So 
a pill. There's a CD. There it is. All right, we got it. There's another one right there. That's an exit. So I can't really get the dog right now. Like, like you, right now is a perfect example of how it's really annoying. Because I can't open this back door to go back where I wanted to. I have to figure out a way to go all the way to a whole new... Like, it's just annoying. It's just annoying. Like, such an unnecessary annoyance. There's a, it, it's like pseudo regalia where there's a lot of small things that make it a more insufferable experience. I would say this game is still a lot better than pseudo regalia. More my style, but if you're trying to get everything, it's like, oh my fucking god, like, I gotta just go all over the place. I gotta just walk all the way around trying to find my way into the map. Because the dog is fucking right over here, and I was over there, and I missed it. We're here. Okay, I could walk this way, and maybe go down, and then around. But no, in my luck, there'll be another door. What's up, Paul? So, we'll walk out here, go straight up, and then we'll take a left down here. Okay. Logs are up to 37. Because I think petting the dogs is kind of an easy one. That one had a door that was easy to open. Oh, well, guess what? The door's blocked off again. But luckily, I can hit a button for this one. Alright, we should be able to get to the dog now. I also wish I could zoom out on the map a little bit and move the map around. It's really annoying that you can't. I just did it again. Wait. Did I save the game? I don't think I did. Did I save? I just walked right past that dog again, to my knowledge. Wait, maybe I didn't. The dog could be here. The dog is not here. I don't think I did save because I'm an idiot, so we're just going to have to walk around again. What esports are going to be in the Olympics? I saw that esports got accepted to be an official Olympic sport, but I haven't had any speculation. My guess is going to be League of Legends. League of Legends, I feel, will uh, make it onto the esports ballot. Collecting, collecting, collecting. We're back, baby. It's the wrong way. 
Beans? Definitely not beans. Overwatch? Maybe. Those type of games are definitely... More prominent in an esports scene. Wait, now I need now I need another goddamn travel log. I need not another travel log. I need a goddamn computer, man. What the fuck is this? Like I wish once you got to a certain point in the game, it would just open up every single door that is like needed to hit a button. Cause then it would actually make it not so miserable. Just open up every single door at once you get to this point in the game for collecting purposes. Just open them. For collection purposes, just open every door. Because as someone who likes to collect... Get collectibles in Metroidvanias especially, this is just so... Annoying enough to go. The dog is right over here. According to this guide that I have, the dog is over here. Why the fuck do I keep doing that, man? I keep doing that. Oh my god, I am so dumb. <laughs> I've done it again for the third time. I should probably know my way there by now. Well, that's unfortunate. It is very fucking unfortunate because I'm an idiot. Every time, dude. Let me show you what this guide looks like. I have a guide for the dogs because there ain't no fucking way I know where these dogs are. Let me show you what this guide looks like when I get to this room again. Which I should know like the back of my hand. Because I've done it eight times. I honestly might just take an elevator to the third floor after this. If we actually get this dog. If it actually exists. I don't know if it does. I'm starting to not be a believer at this point. So, you see where we are in the map. Let me show you the guide. This is what the guide looks like. This is the second floor. This is where the dog is. It could be in here. I feel like it's in here, but I can't zoom in on it. So, I kind of have to make a guess on where the dog is. And I'm guessing it's right here, but it could also be right there now that I'm looking at it. So, I might have to go through it again for the eighth time. Ay ay ay. Ay caramba, man. You guys can see the game, right? So the dogs are invisible? No, they're you that's usually like a secret wall that you can blow up to see the dogs. But there doesn't seem to be one over here. Which means I need to go back. But that means it would be right up here, wouldn't it be? I need to fucking save again. Because my cam- My fucking map keeps dying. We'll save, just in case. Because then I can just restart my checkpoint. this guide the dog should be right over here
There it is. Show the guide map again. There it is. Annoying little fucker. All right, let's go to number three now to get that dog. I'll get the dogs first, because that seems a lot more doable. Where's an elevator? There's an elevator. Puppy! Hey, Natalie. Pet it more. I got, a, I got two other dogs to find, my friend. Two dogs to find. Okay, what's... Let's see. This map is going to be hopefully not as bad. This dog is actually really close to this elevator. The dog should actually be, like, right past this door. In one of these areas. I don't know where. Could be right here. Right here? hi yi yi I also don't think pet and dogs counts towards 100% completion. There's also an achievement called find the dev room and I'm 99% sure I found the dev room. Right here. But I didn't get the achievement for it. Oh, oh thank you. you. Hell yeah, dude. Bunny List Word, thanks for the seven months with the Prime Game, and you get a vote in exclamation mark August. Enjoy the emotes as always. Thank you for the continued support. Can I easily get back here if I leave? I can. Get rid of those. There's a dog in one of these areas, man. Where is this dog? Can you link to the guide? Sure. Uh, the dogs and all the collectibles are on page 12. This guide literally tells you everything to know about the game. I only used the guide during my playthrough when I needed a little help in hand. Uh, so, if you play this game and you use this guide, it will tell you everything you need to do if you don't really want to get too lost. But getting lost Ooh, is sometimes the joy subscriber. of a Metroidvania, you know? Hey. So you see where that dog is right there. This one. Add my votes to the death store again. Sad to see it at such low votes. Eh, some games don't get as much love, sadly. But you never know. Someone could drop like 80 subs and be like, throw it on a game that has no votes. And they'll be like, oh shit, now we're playing that game. Love this demo too, by the way. Happy it's out. This has been a good game. There are a few things I don't like. One thing is, I hate that all the doors don't just, like, automatically open. Because there's a lot of doors that have, like, puzzles that you need to do to, like, get past them. And I can understand that when you haven't, like, progressed the game far enough, you know, the doors shouldn't open. But I've done everything the game has to offer. Just, like, open the doors now so I can easily get my collectibles. It makes collecting stuff so annoying. Where is this fucking dog? It is over here, man. Do you want a hint? You can just tell me where the dog is. I can't find it. It has to be over here, though. The guide says it's over here. I got that, but we don't care about that. It's not in this room. Is it in this room, then? 
Oh, wait, maybe. Wait a minute. Maybe it's in... Maybe it's over here. I actually have very low health. The dog could be in here. Crummy Instagram video. It's already got Instagram videos. What's up, something thing? Alright, we found it. My map is about to die, so I should probably get back to a save point. How do I get in here? I think I came in this way. Save point. There we go. Let's save. Oh, can I pet that dog? You can pet that dog as much as you want, dog. Oh, there's a diamond that's somewhat close by. I should try to get the diamond because collecting the gems lets you get a secret ending. I'll try to collect the gem. Sure. It's all the way at the bottom, though. I'll try. I'll try. I'll try. I don't think these rooms connect, so I need to go this way. Okay. There might actually be a filter in this one. Hey, there's a filter that we got. Black and white filter. Don't care about the filters too much, but might as well collect them. Still missing a good amount of them, though. Easy to get lost in this game. Very easy to get lost in this game. A hundred percent. And it can be very annoying to backtrack to get all the collectibles if you're a collection hunter. Can be incredibly annoying to get them all, but... Yeah, I'm doing it. I'm trying to get four gems right now. There's apparently a gem in here somewhere. I don't think the guide tells you how to get the gems, but there's one in here. Was it 70% to be considered finished for achievements? Yup. And we're at 62 on this game. I would be at like 68%. I would be at, like, 68, but, uh, the infinite mode that has, like, three achievements locked behind it crashes every time I try to go into it after a certain point, so I can't get those achievements. That sucks. Yeah, it really does. Because now I have to do this this obtuse hunting that... There's a gem in here. Well, that gets patched up soon. Yeah, I don't know why it crashes every time. I had the, de the developer in, my, in the stream the last time we played. And at that point, I didn't even get to play... 
I didn't play infinite mode yet because I didn't have it unlocked and now it's so sad. How do I get the gem? It is in this room, but I don't have a clue on how to get it. I, I got the, to, it's the same with the first gem. I got to the room, but there's no clear indication on what you're supposed to do for the gem. No clear indication. Wait. All right, got one. Got one. That's one gem. This does connect us to the other side of the map as well. Hey, shiny. All right. So it's just like uh it's just like the dogs. It's not a it's not a bomb shot. It's just a charged up shot. A charged up shot. This connects us over here, so we'll do this. As soon as you start bitching, you get it. That's usually how it works. Morning Gamer Pro. There's one more dog we need to pet. Let's see if there's any CDs nearby. Did I miss any CDs over here? I did miss one over there. So I guess I could easily walk back and grab this CD. Did I miss any other CDs? There's one right there. There's one right there. There is only two CDs I missed on this floor, so... I think walking back to get it will be a good idea. So let's walk back and grab the CDs. I might as well get 100%. 100% is just all the CDs and all the gems, I think. To my knowledge, the dogs and the dev room do not count towards getting 100% in the game. The minute I either post a rant about some difficulty or in game, but I'll pass in like 20 minutes. That's usually how it works. That's usually how it works. Where was the CD? Okay, up and to the left. Of course, I cannot go through because it's blocked off. This is what I was saying. This is what I was saying. Since I have everything done with the game, I feel like these doors with an X should just automatically be opened because now I have to go all the way around. Which I guess isn't the biggest deal in the world. I just have to, you know, take a couple lefts. But, like, come on, man. Just for convenience sake. Oh, there's a color filter right there as well. Cherry filter. And the filters also don't count towards 100%, but there is an achievement to get them all. I don't know which ones I have and which ones I don't have, but I'm missing a handful. I'm still missing a handful. Reviews for this game, but nothing about crashes. Nothing about crashes. Well, the thing is, the game only crashed. It only crashed. When I was... Wait, the CD's over here. It only crashed when I was playing infinite, infinite mode. It didn't crash any other times. So the game runs very, very well. How the fuck am I supposed to get that? How the fuck... I don't know.
Alright, I got the CD. Where was the other CD? I guess I can go save and put the CD in, and then we can figure out where it was. Also, if you are a Metroidvania fan, I would still suggest this game. It is still very good. It is still very, very good. I've enjoyed it. Just me, me complaining. I'll always complain about something. I'll always find something to bitch about. Wouldn't be a Burr stream if I didn't find something to bitch about. There's also a, uh, I think... Am I even looking at the right map? What the fuck am I looking? Towards the top. Spinning around. There's a filter right over here. Which I guess I could go for. Then take that elevator up the fourth floor. If I go grab this CD. How the hell do I get over there, though? Gotta... Get to the generator room, then take a left, or go up and then take a left. What's your favorite thing to bitch about? Uh, minor inconveniences in video games that in reality don't matter at all. It's a fan favorite of mine. No, no usefulness to the actual societal world that we live in. But I'll bitch about video games. I'll bitch about video games. I'll do it. Complain and tag is here for a reason. Just bitching about nothing. Hey guys, today we're talking about all the things I hate in certain video games. Today's game of discussion... Oh, you guys aren't gonna like this one. We're talking about Elden Ring. This game fucking sucks. No, I'm kidding. I actually like Elden Ring. Wait, streamer, you said something bad about my favorite game. That hurt my feelings. Please rectify the situation immediately and fix this. Please, streamer, please. Apparently a filter over here somewhere. Summer filter. You hate everything though, especially if it's an indie game? That's not true. That's not true, man. Just the way I talk makes people think I hate everything. It's the same when I talk with Kat. She's like, some sometimes she'll be like, why are you yelling? And I'm like, I'm not yelling. I'm just talking. Like, if I talk, like, with this tone of voice, she'll be like, what did I do? Why are you mad at me? It's like, I'm not mad. I'm just talking to you. I'm just talking. I'm just talking. I just have an, a very angry sounding voice, I guess, at times. You literally just yelled. And that was not yelling. That was not yelling. Are you gaslighting me, Kayvon? Yo, Kayvon the gaslighter? There's actually like one more filter here to the right. I should just go get it. I might have got it already, but let's just go get it. Then I never have to peek back on this fucking floor. Maybe that's just a vibe. I don't know. There's people from the East Coast here. And they would be like, oh, no, that's just talking. I ain't yelling. Maybe it's just I got it from my dad. My dad was a very loud, loud individual. He was uh, very much, let's just say loud. And uh, he would, where the fuck is this? I think if I go to this right side, it should be over here. I'm going to save the game as well. Wait a minute. Why are you yelling? I'm not yelling! Yo, calm down, man. Now you are. Yeah, now I am because you asked me such a dumb question. Like, why am I yelling? 
can't understand the gravity of the situation. Okay, so the filter is right over here somewhere. Somewhere over here. I see the filter. Maybe I have to shoot this wall. Boom. The 2600 filter. It's the music that we choose. It's the music that we choose. All right, we're kind of on a roll right now. Kind of on a roll right now. We just cleared out the entire third floor. Me playing Call of Duty 4 on the airplane mission. How we doing? Third floor cleared. Ah, uh, minus two. You ever wonder how the world would react if Call of Duty did that, that, uh, that airport mission in today's day and age? If you don't know what I'm talking about by airport mission, you're too young to know. But if you do know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about, right? How do you think the world would handle a mission like that in 2024? Nobody would care? You think so, man? People care about very minimal things like doors in video games how they're not and how they're not opened when they should be. Hi, it's me. I'm the guy caring about very minimal things. We're actually close to the gem already. The gem should be right here. Two gems. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Wait, I wanted to go to a save to see how many CDs are on this. Can't even have a black samurai today without a causing a crisis, a cultural crisis. I can't believe people got genuinely upset about a black samurai. I didn't think it mattered that much. I thought it was kind of cool. Here's what my thought was. Oh shit, a samurai. If you're the first thought when you see that is, oh my god, he's black. Congrats, you're racist. Sorry you had to find out this way, but mm, you had to find out eventually. Where's the dog? Oh god, the dog is all the way in this bottom corner. Next to this elevator, or next to this terminal. Fucking Christ. Well, actually, I can go down here. There's a filter on this right side that we can grab in this room. Oh, Jesus. Right here, actually, in the middle. I might have grabbed... Did I grab that filter? I'm not sure if I did. Uh, grab that filter. We can go down from here. Take it right here. Grab the CD. Grab the filter. And then grab the dog down there. There's another filter right over here that we can get. Continue on this left side that we can grab another filter right over here. We might've grabbed some of these already. And then we can come back up and grab this CD last. And then this elevator can take us back to the second floor to get the second floor gem. Ah, uh, there's fucking so many filters though. All right. 
All right. Everybody, hands in. One, two, three, break. One, two, three, break. There we go. Let's go. Good job, everybody. Like Matthew said, gamers' favorite thing is fake outrage. It's their favorite thing. Have you ever cared about an actual thing that was, like, outraged in video games? And then you heard about it and you were like, what? And then you just think, who cares? It happens a lot. They're so minimal in the world to me that when they do happen, I just... I don't even have a second thought. I'm just like, oh, I don't care. I'll forget about that in a few weeks. We got the CD. Alright, we got the CD. You prefer fake enrage? I, I respect that, Adernus. These people are not familiar. Who cares what race, gender, sexual orientation they are? Oh, but the woke media, man. The woke media. They're putting chemicals in the water that are making the frogs gay. Who cares if the frogs are gay? The frogs don't care. Why do you care? Since when do you care about frogs, motherfucker? Last I checked, you didn't care about frogs or their sexual orientation. Damn it. I need to get this filter. All right, the filter is in here. I need to somehow open that door. But I don't know how to open said door. Hey gamers, just here to inform you that Fist Forged and Shadow Torch is free on Epic Games from now until August 1st. This Cyberpunk Metroidvania has an 88% positive rating and it takes 20 hours to 100%. Play it if you want, I guess. Fist Forged and Shadow. Can I play it on Steam? I'd rather pay for it on Steam. I'd rather pay for it on Steam than get it for free on Epic. <laughs> oh god, it's $40. Uh, 40 Canadian dollars. I don't even... Sp Japanese. Intense and challenge in combat. you make for 40 Canadian? I actually just made chicken today. I'll add it to my wish list and buy it on sale. I'll buy it on sale when it's like 80% off on Steam in the next summer sale. Now I gotta figure out how to open this door. There's a filter behind that door, and I don't know how you even open said door. Because there's magnets everywhere. Where's Zark when we need him? In a situation like this, I would straight up just ask the developer if he was here, how do I open this door? I don't got a clue, man. was last at $10.50 in the summer sale. See, that's a good deal. $10.50? I'm 
dying. Where is the button? Enjoy the meetings if that's possible. But thanks for hanging out for a little bit. There's no way to beat the turret. No. Maybe I have to open every door. But that wouldn't really make any sense. Because it's, it's a door that has... That you need to open it with a button. Also, welcome to the stream, Sphinx. Welcome to the stream. Indie Gala? What is Indie Gala? It's a key store. I've never used one of those key stores before. Does anyone see a big red button? Besides that one? You use them a lot? They're solid? Huh. Oh. We're going to be stuck here for another hour just trying to get this one goddamn filter. The good news is the last dog is after this, or another filter is after this. No button. No button. I got hit. No button. No button. I mean, I imagine if you're doing key reselling, it would be near impossible to get a refund if you don't like a game. What, can they remove it from your library? Maybe I can kill the turret with it. Can I kill the turret by just making it shoot itself? Don't know how to open this fucking door. Is everyone having for lunch? Chicken wraps.
I've used Humble Bundle too. Cat was accidentally subscribed to Humble Bundle for a long time. When we first started dating, she didn't realize it. So she had like 800 game keys. Where's Zark when we need him? Maybe there's a guide on the game already to help this one. I would use a guide. Are there any guides? There are no guides for Exophobia. That's unfortunate. The blueberry pancakes for lunch? That sounds nice. Is it bad if I'm convinced he forgot to put a red key in this room or something? Is it bad if I'm convinced of that? Oh my god, I don't know what needs to be done here. Guess who found the fourth hidden yuck? Not you. We did get to the next yuck on the yuckathon, which is the Batman yuck. Cat is up. Cat is up. It's at a seven if you want to. It's your choice. You can look out there. It was so smoky this morning, gamers, because fucking Jasper National Park is on fire. And is burning down as we speak. And Jasper National Park is three hours like west of us. You have a bug out bag just in case? Nope. It shouldn't be that bad, though. We, I don't think our city's ever had to evacuate from a fire. We're also pretty far away. Fourth yuck is bullshit. And Gestalt, Steam, and Cinder? I, uh, I gave a hint on it. It's on one of the item screens. When the game is paused and looking at all the items. It's on one of those screens. Can happen you're right you think it can't happen but then it does someone find the loop hero one i gave that one out i didn't think anyone was gonna find it falcus sent me where they were looking and they were like 200 pixels off and i was like okay falcus doesn't see it right here then there's no one no one's gonna find it where is this I am calling the developer right now. Zark! Zark, where are you? Also, if you're not subscribed to the channel, ads start in a minute and a half. What up, Bernas? I think this game is really, really good. I, I, I already beat it, technically. I'm just trying to get some completion hunting. Um, I'm having a hard time trying to get this filter in this door because I don't know where to go personally, but... I found it just now. Never mind, we don't need Zark. Uh, but the game is really good. Your friend did a great job, Bernas. And you're a great friend for watching the game as well. I hope you enjoyed it, if you played it. I got it. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I just had to look. I just had to look. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. You guys can call me an idiot. You, I, I'm waiting for them to come back so I can tell them about the crashes. That's one negative thing I've had in the infinite mode. In infinite mode, every time I'm getting close to the fourth wave of infinite mode, the game crashes on me. I've, and I gave the game integrity with the files and that didn't work, so. 
That is like the biggest and only negative that I have are those crashes because I'm trying to get everything in the game done and I can't get everything done when the game crashes. I'll go this way. Wait, 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 wait. All right, wait, let me go this way. Let's save and put the CD in. Yeah, Infinity Mode, uh, it was always the third the third area on the third floor of Infinity Mode. Each floor has four levels of enemies you have to fight, giving you different enemies from each floor in the game. Always on the third floor, in the third level of that floor, the game always bugs out at the end. And it's like, man, that really sucks. I only have four more CDs to get, and they're on the goddamn first floor, which I hate for me. Alright, let me look at the map. We have a dog down here to get. We have a filter over here. Ads have started. I'm sorry, gamers. A filter over here. A dog here. We have another filter over here. Is there any CDs? There's one CD over here that we need to get. And then this area is cleared out. Actually, minus... I scratched that. There's a filter right over here that I need to get. I think in this room. Wait, I'm right near that. Fuck it. Let's go get this filter. Fucking right there. Is this the dev room? Because there's an achievement called Find the Dev Room. And I thought for sure this was it. There's a big question mark on it. Let me see if the big question mark says anything. It is technically the dev room, but I don't know what I have to do to make the achievement unlocked. So maybe I have to sh The guide said if you shoot the wall inside the dev room, a memorial will unlock. Was this the memorial? Rest in peace, Ricardo. It's the memorial to him. Maybe I have to shoot it from inside something else. Like in here. Either way, there's a filter next to it, and I don't know if I got the filter or not. I might have got the filter from the vending machine. I 
I don't know what to do with this room. Here, I'll read you guys the dev room secret out, and you tell me what you feel. Floor 4 has a floating character in the room on top of the right elevator. Look behind the wall. Also, if you shoot the wall inside the dev team room, you'll find a memorial to a friend of mine. Rest in peace, Ricardo. Pretty sure this is the dev room. You got that already? But I didn't get an achievement. Like, rest in peace, Ricardo, but... Pet all the dogs. Defeat the Alien King. Find the dev team. Is A1 here? We need a 7 TV emote. This is definitely the room, but I guess some achievements might just be bugged. It's unfortunate. I have so many bugged achievements, it feels like. So many bugs that are blocking me from getting so many achievements in this game. Is that Ricardo Flick? All right, well. I gotta go around, I think. Can I even go around? I think I can. Ricardo Flick, that's a name I haven't heard in a long time. Random Zarconians hanging about. What the hell is that? How do I even get over there again? It's a reference to another Portuguese game. Ah, okay. Explains why I wouldn't get it. Okay, well, we have to go the long way. We're gonna save. Town Seeker. I know the name of the game, but I also know I haven't played it. Of course, the one I need to is blocked off. We gotta go the long way for this goddamn dog. We already got the uh, the filter. CD right over here. Cat did add those emotes between streams. More Zarconians. I think I've almost killed all the Zarconians. <laughs> hey, old my bad man. We got the CD.
Does this connect to another area for me? It doesn't. I just get baited. It's like this part of the, the part is like the part of the map I'm trying to access not accessible or something. Oh god, let me look at the map again. Let's 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 look at the map again. We'll save. We need to pet the dog. We need to get gems on floor two and one. Spaceship map. We can't get to it from like anywhere. This door is blocked off, of course. I don't think I can get from it from over here because we can't get over there. We have to come down from this elevator, I guess. Wait, even then we still can't get to over here. How the fuck do I get over here? This is where the dog is. I have to come down from this elevator. If I want to get that dog and that filter. You see, that's another annoying thing for me. This is a me issue. Since I've already, like, beat the game and I've kind of done everything. In terms of, like, trying to collect stuff. Like, I beat the story. I just have to keep going through all these elevators. I have to just find the right way. And it's... Annoying. <laughs> like, that's the last dog that I need, but it's not connected. Like, going there doesn't do me anything. Going through here doesn't do me anything. You would think this would connect it, but no, it does not. So I guess I gotta go through an elevator and find where to go. I guess I should go back over here and find the closest elevator to me. Is that an elevator or is that... No, I can't even get to that elevator, even though it's... I don't think it is an elevator. I think I got all the CDs, though, here, so that's good. Okay, all the CDs are done. How the fuck did I even get here? Terminal. Heels and escalators. Elevator. Okay, I think I got here from there. So I just go straight into the left. Straight into the left, then we'll go to floor two. We have to get the gem on floor two, so we'll go there to do that. We have to come back to floor four, though, to pet the last dog and get one of the filters. I've pet the dog on floor two. I don't recall getting the gem, though. So let me look at the floor two map. And we got the dog. The gem is on the right side of the map. There's actually a couple filters over here, I think. Off this elevator. There's actually one supposedly in this room, but I've already went in this room, so I think... Yeah, I got that filter. That one's already got. Gotta get get. Gotta get 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 get. We'll go through here. We're just going for the gem next right now. We will see if I uh, am missing any CDs here.
Don't tell me I need to get down on this elevator. I think this elevator right here actually will get me to the fourth floor easily. So if I can get to that elevator, that would be really nice. I did miss a CD, though, down here. The thing is, this part of the map seems very disconnected. The gem is right over here. If I can get into this part, this will be perfect. The gem and a CD is what we need. Maybe I just go down to the fourth floor as well, just to be safe. Don't think I'm missing anything else in terms of CDs. I think just maybe two filters? Maybe even one filter? There's a filter in this action. There's actually a filter in this corner of the map. Motherfucker. That door is blocked off. You have got to be kidding me, man. <sighs> How much is shipping to the UK? You've got to be fucking kidding me. Let me go look at the map again. Do I have to go all the way down? How am I supposed to get back in that room then? If that... I have to go from this way. Okay. I have to go from all the way down here. I think we have to go here, down to the right. Then maybe we can get connected over here. All right. Shrimp mouse mat, $4 for that. Did you get the last yuck? Save yourself $25. Okay, this is where we want to be. There's a gemstone here somewhere, and then there's that elevator we want to go through. We can keep saving. Here comes the money. Money, 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 money. I have five items. I wish I could hold multiple little buddies, but I can't. Before we do anything else, I'm gonna go pet that dog. Because I think we got where we needed to be for the dog. And a filter. Maybe. We'll see. The dog is all the way down in the corner. Wait, there's a filter here. I might have missed it. Finally close to beating part of this game. The soothing burst room has helped me keep my rage in check. 40 minutes to be one level. Fun devs, not exophobia. Let me clarify. What well, game is on your docket of games making you lose your mind? Forty minutes to be one level. 
It's not over here. Pet all dogs. Achievement unlocked. Alright, I pet all the dogs. A singular strike. Fiona! Sleepy Bongo. Super Magbot. Never heard of that one. Fiona! Thanks for the 44 months. 41 months of the tier 1 subbing. I greatly appreciate it. I hope you enjoy the emotes as always. Thank you for the continued support. You have a singular vote in exclamation mark back or an exclamation mark August on whatever game you want in that little list. I pet all the dogs. I have 64% done. That means I need three more achievements. We're going up 2% at a time. Three more. There's a filter over here somewhere. I don't know how to get it, though. The thing is, I don't want to lose where I am. Because I have the perfect elevator right now. Yeah, I'm going to lose where I am with this elevator, so we're going to go back to the second floor now and get these last couple items down here. We have pet all the dogs. We're going to get all the gems. I don't think there's a CD here. This gem is kind of hard to tell where it is. I'll double check the CDs in here. There's one right down here. The gem is in this room right here. So if I go there, we should be fine if I go get that CD. when it's that easy. I love it when you call me senorita. I wish I was a soldier. I never w even went in this room. If it isn't a yuck, please don't give any of the clues, though, other than saying yes or no, probably no. You can send me a screenshot, yes. Can you vote for Portal 2? No! Yes, you can. Portal 2 is up to 30 votes. 30 votes. Let me see, focus. Uh, no, that's not it. And I can't tell you if you're on the right screenshot of the whole thing or not, but that's not it, no. You have the right idea. I would say it's not that, it's not that little, I'm not gonna tell you anything else. All right. <laughs> Anyways, I pet all the dogs. I need this gem. Wait, 
There's the door. All right. There's three gems. That's three gems. Now I gotta get back to the teleporter and go to the first floor. That's three though. Not the teleporter, the elevator. Up and to the right is the elevator. We have to go to the first floor. We will save our progress most definitely. How many CDs are we missing? We're missing two CDs, and I think they're both on the first floor. All right, guys, we're almost done. We can get this game done within, like, a three-hour mark. We're going to get the good ending, too. We're going to get the good ending. We need three achievements, but we're about to get one of them by getting these CDs, I imagine. And we just need to get this gem as well. So let's find out where the CDs are. The gem is in the top right corner. Actually, maybe I can sneak over there. Oh, this fucking map. I hate this map. This first area is so annoying because everything is locked behind these damn doors. And I trying to get this little puzzle figured out that they have is incredibly annoying. This is where the gemstone is supposedly. Somewhere in this area. Like, why put this connector right here if I can't actually connect between the two? You know what I mean? There goes Burr again. Good old Burr. Hashtag complaining. We have gotten all the gems. Now, there is only one thing left to do, is get the CDs. We are at 96%. We are missing two CDs, and I think both of them are on this goddamn annoying floor. Got the gems. We'll save it. We can do the final boss now whenever we're ready. All right, CDs. We're missing two of them. Terminal, terminal. There's one of them right there. There's the other one right there. Okay, so there's one CD, and then there's two. We are very far away, but let's, uh, let's go figure out how to get them. His sword is still stuck. An idiot.
You never know. One of them could be a secret door that leads to the CD. Like, I need this door opened, but I don't know how to open it. I figured out how to open it. It's fine. This fucking door is out I don't know how to open. That's a door. This is a door. This game is filled with these X doors that don't open unless you go in from another side. So there's got to be like a secret somewhere. And that's the annoying part of it. And now I can't even get back there, so... This is why I hate this first floor. Now my map is going away. Another door I can't get out of. And now I'm basically just stuck here. I feel like I'm overcomplicating it, you know? I feel like I'm overcomplicating this damn door. Yo, what up, Danny? Am I near the other one at least? I'm not. I don't even know where the other one is. The other one's over here. I don't even know if I can get over there. No, I have to get this one. How do I get that? How do we get that? Hope you're doing good, Danny. We are trying to get the last two CDs in this game. It was actually so simple the whole time. All you had to do was walk. You see, you guys, this is where you point and laugh at me and say, okay, you're an idiot. Yeah. I will... Agree. All I had to do was walk. Cheryl Crow, all she wants to do is have some fun. All I gotta do is walk.
one more CD. Wowber, you know where you're going. No, I don't. I'm putting the CD in, though. 43 of 44 collected. Travel log, captain's orders. We have one more CD to find. It's down on this right side of the map. than fruits wow i'm better than fruit don't tell me this i don't want to get an ego hey yo did you guys know this stream is better than fruits yeah you heard it right better than fruits You heard it here second. We're getting close towards the end here, actually. So since we're getting close to the end, shout out to YouTube for watching this. It's been a very good game. I've had some complaints, but... Hashtag complaining, that's me. I'm always complaining. That's my specialty, baby. Never stop. Like Roy Jones Jr. What game are we looking forward to the most the next? What do you guys want to see? If you don't know what games are available in the Metroidvania Mania, you can type Metroidvania or Mania with an exclamation mark in front of it, and it'll tell you all the remaining games that we have left. If it has a green check mark next to it, that means it's done. I think I've walked by this thing quite a bit. You don't know the, only know the names because of the list. You don't know any of them? 30 seconds into the Gestalt short. Uh, on your screenshot, Falcus, I'm 99% sure it is on that screenshot you sent me. One that Duke Nukem shoot in this game. What up, Peck? This is a boomer shooter-inspired Metroidvania game called Exophobia that came out a couple days. I'm trying to get 70% achievements because that's what we do. That's what we do. How are you? It has been a very good time, though. I don't know how to open these doors. I am in a groundhog scenario. What up, Phalia? Welcome to Groundhog Day. Just call me Bill Murray. Burr Murray. Burr Murray!
Bill Murray coded. I get that a lot. Yeah, I've seen Ghostbusters 842 times. What of it? Yeah, I played the Ghostbusters video game on stream. <laughs> what of it? I did actually play the Ghostbusters video game on stream. I played it on professional mode because I'm a professional Ghostbuster. Also, Peck, I hope you're great. You're good. You got spicy Popeye Sammy and ready to watch. Well, you're just in time because we have one more CD to collect. And then after said CD is done and collected, we can uh, fight the final boss, which is a secret final boss because we have... We have collected everything in the game. And we will see how we do. So you like Bustin? What I can tell you is Bustin makes me feel good. Oh no, not this shit again. God damn it. I'm about to run out of power on my map. So, Faye, I hope you're doing good. I don't know if I ever ask you if I hope you're doing good. I ask everyone. Hey, hope you're doing good. But I don't know if I've ever asked you. Fuck. Okay. Wait, I remember this room. I remember this. Die trying to do this. How much is that when I'm not even sure if I like Metroidvanias? I think Guacamelee has been the most hyped for game on this Metroidvania mania. If that's any scale to go off of. When I ask people, what game are you most excited for? I feel Guacamelee is usually...
watermelon filter? Fuck! That's not what I needed. Well, I don't want to lose it, so I need to go save now. God, now we're in watermelon mode. Oh, no. Oh, fine. I'll do this all again. Oh, my God. Hey! Fuck. I went the wrong way. I don't want to lose my filter I just got. Watermelon filter is cute, though. It is kind of cute. Oh. I have found most of the filters now. I'll keep it on for the people. Where's the CD at? It was in that jumbo of a mess. I'm pretty sure it's over here because I don't have any comprehension of it being anywhere else. Okay. Pretty sure we have to get through this little maze. You like this filter. How did you unlock it, or was it available from the start? I just unlocked it now. To unlock the filters in this game, you have to find the little filter cartridges. There's lots of them, and I have not found many of them. Skibbity Riz, that's not what we did. How did I get there before? Oh my god. Oh my god. This last damn CD. The last CD is right here. I went over here and it led to nothing. But maybe I need to go back over there. Like, we got three doors over here that we can't open. Destroyable wall. I've tried. And then we go back over here. And it kills me instantly. This is just the last fucking CD. I wish the developer was watching. Because this last CD... Well, I was on the first floor yes, than the last time we played. Looking for CDs. Like this. And I got stuck on this exact one. And was like, okay. I guess I'm not doing this one. Because I could not figure it out. Which is ridiculous, because it's the first freaking floor.
I mean, there's a, been a handful of secret walls in the game. I don't think I've shot this room up yet. Oh my god. So my last guess on where it could be is the room where I got the watermelon filter, which is this room right here. Because I'm pretty sure there's a door right over there. But I don't know how I got in there because all the doors blocked me off. How, on God's green earth, did I get into that room? I did finish Cocoon. I actually went back and got all the achievements in it off stream. We're back in the room. I missed, like, seven of them. But I did go back and get them all. Uh, where, where, where is Zark? Where's the dev? Uh, dev, where, where are you? I will straight up ask the dev if he's here. No shame, man. A false wall you walk through? Well, that hasn't happened in the entire game, so I wouldn't think so. I'll just blow myself up. <sighs> the thing about the conveyor belt room, those three walls all have... We'll save here. They all have something in common. These doors usually open with a switch. There is no switch anywhere to be found for these doors. God, it's at 97% completion.
I like I I genuinely don't know, man. There's got to be a secret wall in here that has a switch. Like that. What the fuck? There's not even an item in here. What? Oh. Oh! Well. Uh, find all CDs. Achievement unlocked. There's an achievement for killing all the Zarconians, but apparently I haven't done that yet. You'll take credit for that? I'll give you credit. I'll give anyone credit for that. We got all the CDs, though. Now let's go do the secret ending. And then with the secret ending, we will see what the achievement percentage is looking like. If it's at 70%, we're done with this game. I think this is the wrong way. Ugh. Can't believe I didn't see. I can't believe I didn't. Ugh. Uh, suddenly I see. Suddenly I see. All right, let's do this. Ads start in a minute and a half, by the way. So good luck. Don't get them. You're two achievements away from 70. Oh my god. For surviving that Chivo. Bunny Lizward with the 1500 bits? Yo! Where do you want those three votes? Three votes! Three votes! I'm probably gonna need two achievements. Most games round up. Beat my game so we are twins. Let's go. Death's door. I love when people call me good sir. It's like, people, when people call me sir, they're like, yes sir, and I'm like, oh, we're fancy now. Even though I say yes ma'am and yes sir to like everybody. Someone's talking to me, I'm like, yes ma'am. All right, let's do it. We need two achievements. I think we'll get one achievement for getting the secret ending. We're at 98% completion, I guess. But I have the four gems. A1, are you getting nervous that I'm getting all these achievements in these games at a pretty good pace? You got called ma'am and you hated it. You're not that old. It's not really an age thing. It's more so just... I feel like it's a good sign of respect, you know? Let's call someone sir, call somebody ma'am. I'm not gonna call somebody I don't respect sir. I'll probably not talk to them. Uh, ads have started. If you are not subscribed, enjoy the ads.
got called boy last week and upset me more than it should have. I hate it. I hate being called kid. Like, even if someone's older than me, like... I hate that that's an insult in so many areas that people just call other people, like, kid. Maybe they don't mean it as an insult. Like, you can mean somebody's young, but it's like, you don't gotta call them kid. It's okay, sport. Oh, God. It feels like you're talking down on me when you say that. First you as kiddo. But that's different. That's your mother-in-law, you know? Those are your in-laws. They have to call you kiddo and kids. Like, hey, kid, how you doing? But like a person, like a random person. Hey, kid. It's like, okay, first off, no. I don't know, maybe I'm just an idiot. Your SO's dad said, give the boy a break, so I'm sure he meant well, but we're like, no thank you. Your grandpa starts every conversation with, what you say, boy? Maybe I'm just overthinking it. accidentally blew myself up. I do reference my kids as the kids. Yeah, that's different. God. I mean, have four health, and there's like two bosses I'm gonna need to fight. I didn't even get my hit off. Got him once. This is not the final boss, by the way. This We've already killed this guy before. Push the mecha head into a pit. I got an achievement without even trying. All right, he's dead. 
I'll be honest, I didn't even know how to get this achievement. I knew it was there. I don't even know how I just got that achievement. I'm at 69%. Okay. If the achievement unlocked for, you know, finding the dev room, I would have had that one done. I hopefully don't need to go through this entire thing again. Oh, they're clapping for me now. Oh, wait, he's easy. Ha! Wait, he's easy to kill. Defeat the Alien King. Achievement unlocked. Well, well, well. That's game number four out of nine. Give that game a check mark. We're done with this one, man. We're done with it. Wrap up achievements after the backlog next month. I hope so. I hope so. A lot of games I need to go back and get a bunch of achievements for. This game has some pretty annoying achievements towards the end of it as well. Like beat the game without dying, beat the game in X amount of time. That shit's so annoying. What's up with Metroidvanias and making awful achievements? So we're gonna get Always Awakening, we're gonna get Exo- or not Exophobia, The Messenger, Yoku's Island Express, or Guacamelee next. YouTube, let's play, like, and subscribe. We got two and a half extra hours of Exophobia. We did get uh, some good achievements. We got 71% achievements, 32 out of 45. Uh, yeah, beat boss rush without da beat boss rush without damage. I think that means without taking damage. Complete the game with three health points. Complete the game without dying. Complete the game in less than two hours. Yeah, there's some annoying achievements in this game. Annoying achievements. We got the good ending though, so that's good.